Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Today we present you 50 beautiful retro historical photos. We hope you will appreciate our work. Write your comment and click the subscribe button. Enjoy the show and here we go. English model handsome Gail McKenna 1988. Serbian actress and beauty Nadia Regan 1953. October 9th, 65. New York World's Fair. Young redheaded son of Mr. John Semenya of Yonkers, New York. Nineteen sixty Plymouth Belvedere Hardtop on Boston Street, nineteen sixty four, along with a going nineteen fifty nine Chevrolet wagon. Boston, nineteen sixty three, records for sale in Hi Fi Store, where the Fi goes at least as high as Blaupunkt Multiplex Stereo. Chrysler Pavilion under construction New York World's Fair, 1964. New York, 1961. Mayoral campaign car with loudspeakers. Jerry Biltmore Fire, Boston, 1963. Aftermath of the fight alarm blaze that killed four on March 29, 1963. San Francisco circa 1919. Columbia Six Touring Car. Note the rakishly tilted windshield. nineteen sixty four New York State Pavilion New York World's Fair The Mezzanine Tour looks just about our speed From a newspaper morgue somewhere in California comes this undated medium format mid century negative with the sketchy notation Oakland Service Station who can help us to fill in the blanks? Circa 1910. Columbus, Ohio, from Great Southern Hotel. Photobombed by the mail pouch tobacco horse. Tropical greenery notwithstanding, this isn't Bora Bora, Anaheim, or even Orlando. 1965, Monorail Station, New York World's Fair, Flushing Meadows, is the caption. This Australian 1959 Ford Fairlane 500 is a close relative to the Yank Tank. The Victoria license plate GZT500 matches the model number nicely.
June 7, 1957. Exterior scenes in St. George, Utah. Local residents being interviewed about their feelings on nuclear testing. October 11, 1961. New York Civil Defense Commission Family Shelter Display. Man and woman at stove cooking. Somewhere in America circa 1954, and it seems to be a big day for Junior. Maybe he just got his driver's license, or his first car, or figured out how to open the door. From the mid-1950s, somewhere in the U.S. of A, come these two boys arguing about who's hotter. Feel free to improvise your own caption in the comments. San Francisco circa 1920. Franklin Auto at Franklin Motor Car Company. Note the Yellowstone Park sticker. Columbus, Georgia, circa 1951. Military funeral. One in a series of photos showing a quartet of flag-draped caskets. Georgia historians please fill in the blanks. Judy Wangel is all it says here. Who knew Judy? San Francisco, 1930. Essex Super 6 climbing Webster Street Hill. Elgin, Illinois, circa 1956. Pony eating cake at birthday party. It's a living. Circa 1958. Plymouth meets Peaches in the first of a series of car crash photos taken in and around Oakland, California. Oakland, California, circa 1957. Collision aerial. Aftermath of a crash between a Kaiser sedan and a 1957 Chevy Coupe. Reno, Nevada in the summer of 1972. This is another Kodachrome slide from a small trove we recently found at my friend's house. This time you'll look in vain for me in funny clothes, because I wasn't along on this trip. Oakland, California, circa 1959. Garbage truck accident. With lots of vintage unsorted refuse destined for the landfill or incinerator. Or in this case, your front lawn. American actress Michelle Bauer, 1979. 
circa 1908. Wood Street, Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. A good look at the street rail infrastructure in place 115 years ago. Oakland, California, circa 1958. Another look at the motor mashup seen here yesterday. August 1941. Calba in the Corral at Quarter Circle U, Brewster Arnold Ranch Company. Bernie, Montana. From somewhere around Columbus, Georgia, circa 1957 comes this unidentified lady on a Schwinn, pre-spandex. Circa 1903. Unloading fish at T. Wharf, Boston, Massachusetts. San Francisco circa 1926. Alice Joyce and Bo Jess Locomobile. Evidently promoting the film. Oakland, California, circa 1958. Our third look at the collision between a Plymouth sedan and GMC tractor. November 1942. Track crews repairing tracks in the roundhouse at the Illinois Central Rail Yard, Chicago. Columbus, Georgia, in 1951. Mrs. Luther Wolf and her brood of squirrels. Nuts will make your children strong. San Francisco, 1920. Moon touring car and tire chains in Golden Gate Park. Columbus, Georgia, circa 1960. Municipal pool. Oakland, California, circa 1958. Wrecked auto car reefer. August 1941. Calba and horse at the Quarter Circle U, Brewster Arnold Ranch Company. Bernie, Montana. Circa 1903. Fishing schooner at T. Wharf, Boston. With ice at the ready. Columbus, Georgia, circa 1959. Swim camp. Boys at park. 
making a break from the bus. Columbus, Georgia, circa 1953. Snow's Laundry. With plenty of free parking for your car, bike, or wagon. San Francisco, circa 1925. Nash Special 6 two-door sedan, equipped with full balloon tires, five-disc wheels, four-wheel brakes, Duco finish, mohair upholstery. From circa 1960 comes this uncaptioned news archive photo of a family whose reading would seem to favor religious and inspirational titles chief among them the Bible and Mother's Lap. Nineteen oh eight, Spalding Hotel, Duluth, Minnesota. Next door to the more intimate Hotel Windsor, Oakland, California, circa 1955. Wrecked Buick, a 1953 super convertible. Long before airbags, there were collapsible steering columns and dish steering wheels. And before that, there was this. Bonus photo for you a beautiful retro woman. The beautiful and charming Linda Lusardi, 1979. This is the end of our performance. We hope you enjoyed it and appreciate our work. See you in the next performance. Have a good day.